video number two in the series Basic Simultaneous Interpretation. I am Matt Ellsworth, as always, your host, and uh, today we're going to pick up where we left off in the last video. I was talking about parroting, acting like a parrot, repeating what you hear. I have uh, recruited Steve Jobs. I went to YouTube. I searched for the term speech. I chose one that was well-paced for me in the early stages. It's slow. It's clear. And you're going to hear me, you're going to hear Steve Jobs, and then you're going to hear me parroting him. And today's focus in this just short video is on building the space, the fallback, making sure that I hear and repeat. Your job is not to repeat people's words in the same language, but what we're doing now is creating mental space to do that. All right, so we're going to parrot. And today we're going to parrot and try falling back a little bit. So listen up. Dots will somehow connect in your future. The dots would you somehow connect with your future. Your gut, you destiny, your life, your karma, gut, whatever. Your life, because karma, believing that whatever. The dots will connect believing down the that road. the dots will connect down the road. Will give the you the confidence, confidence to follow even your when heart. Lead you off even when it leads you path. off the well-worn path. And that path. will make all the difference. And that will make all the difference. Now, the decollage. Wait for it. Talk to me, Mr. Jobs. My second story is about love and loss. My second story is about love. I was lucky and lost. I found what I loved I to do. I was lucky. Early I found what I loved to Roz do. Was and I started out in my parents' garage when I was out twenty. In we my parents' hard. garage. When and I was twenty years after we the worked hard. Just the two of us in the garage. And in the ten years, with two billion dollars in the garage, we built a thousand billion dollar company. We just released our finest creation, the Macintosh, a year earlier. And I just turned. I didn't know that he was going to do this, but he just gave us a very important lesson. I was working on parroting. I was working on the distance, and then suddenly he gave me a couple of numbers. Keep something handy to write them down. Now you go out and do this practice. Choose a speech. You can find plenty of them. Pair it. Create that space. Next time we'll work on one more refinement that will make it even more important to you. Thanks. Watch for number three. Bye now.